Hey guys, it's me again. Sorry, I look horrid today. Uh, I just got out of the shower. Um, I went hiking today with my friend Alicia. Ugh, you guys, that hike was horrible. I, ugh, it was horrible. But I, I kind of liked it because it kind of pushed me out of my comfort zone, so it was nice. Um, the reason I'm making this really quick video is because, um, so I told you guys that I was put on metformin, which is for women that have an insulin resistance in their body, I guess, and my doctor didn't really test me for it, but he kind of assumed that it would help me, you know, lose a lot of my weight, and, you know, I've been active and stuff, and hopefully help balance my hormones more. Um, the only thing, you guys, and the reason why I make this video is because, so I started taking my Letrozole, which is my Femera, on Friday when I went to the doctor, which was my day three, and the metformin, because I had to take two pills a day, I didn't, I started taking it on Saturday in the morning. You guys, I had only been on this pill for four days the metformin, and I did not like it. My body, for some reason, just didn't agree with it, or I, I, to be honest, you guys, I don't know. It just did not, it didn't like it. I've been having really, and it's only in the morning, because I, I take one, like, at 8 o'clock in the morning after I eat, because they don't want you to take it on an empty stomach, so I took it, and I started getting really nauseous and, um, you know, which is one of the side effects. But I just, it kind of persisted till the next day and the next day and the next day. And then, of course, on like, when was it? Not yesterday, but like Tuesday. Um, or no, it started Monday. So, yeah, Monday. You guys, I know this is TMI, but I have to share. I mean, that's what this vlog is about. It's your experience and everything. But one of the side effects is also not just nausea, but um, diarrhea, which is horrid. Um, my body, you guys, I was, like, crying because I felt like, and I know this is TMI, and I'm really, really sorry, but I felt like, all I was going to the bathroom in my number two was acid. It, you know, it was horrible. I don't think I've had that pain going to the bathroom number two ever. Um, I ended up having, and the day before that I had really bad heartburn, which is uncommon for me usually. And so the day after that is when I had the really bad bowel movement. I'll call it that because diarrhea is a crappy word. Um, and like I said, it was really yellow like acid. I felt like it was just, you know, my food wouldn't stay. I felt like I'd eat something and it would just go through me. Um, I ended up making my husband go buy me some Imodium. And luckily, that kind of calmed my stomach a little bit. Um, and then I took a half a pill the next day just to kind of see if my stomach would kind of react a little bit different to it. Well, it didn't. Um, it, again, gave me bad, you know, you know. And, I mean, it got to the point where I was, like, crying because it hurt so bad. And so I had to take another Imodium to calm my stomach down. And ever since then, I've been okay. But I ended up calling my nurse. She's an on-call nurse for um, my fertility doctor. I called her because I just the nausea is horrible in the during the day. At night, I feel like it's weird because it doesn't affect me at all at night. So I called her, and she called me back, and she said that that's usually normal. A lot of people, that's why they told us to kind of hang in there, bear with it. Um, I feel like it's horrible, though. So she just told me to wean myself a little little by little. So she asked me when the nausea was the worst. And, of course, I said it's during the day because it is. And um, then she said to just take the pill, one pill at night. 
and just kind of gradually keep adding um, the second pill to see how my body reacts to it. And I've found that when I take the pill at night, it doesn't it doesn't bother me at all. I don't get nauseous and I don't get any diarrhea or anything. I don't get any any of the side effects at night, which is so weird. Now my friend that's TTCing also Alicia, I did the five tag thing with her. Um, she had a little bit of it, but not as bad as I did, and she didn't really have as bad nausea as I did. Um, I have to take this pill for six day, you guys. Uh, oh, no, not 60 days. Sorry, a month, but it's like 60 pills. So it's really difficult. So I'm trying to bear with it. So little by little, I'll start introducing the second pill. Um, and then, yeah, I just wanted to kind of let you guys know what was going on with that. Um, I was worried that maybe going down one pill would affect my chances of making my IUI go better. I'm really nervous about that, you guys. I'm not going to lie. I'm really, um, I'm really scared that it won't work the first time and it'll just be money down the drain. Um, it's kind of expensive, but I know that it's worth it. Um, so tomorrow is when I go for my ultrasound. I will be on day cycle... Let me see, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So ten, my day cycle ten, um, and that's when they're gonna check my follicles to see how, if they, if I have any big ones or anything, and and depending on that, if I do have any big follicles, then they'll give me the trigger shot and the progesterone suppositories, and start that, and then I don't know when they would have me do the sperm and everything like that. So I, I'll i find all that out tomorrow, you guys, and I will make a video and let you guys know how my ultrasound went, and I will probably look prettier than right now. <laughs> so this is just me not pretty looking. Um, not not pretty looking, but like... Anyways, um, okay, so... I don't know why, you guys, but... Never mind, I'm not even going to say it, but, um, I hope you get, I, they, ugh, I can't even talk, and so, like, I had a, I was going to say something, and it just gave me the biggest brain fart, um, but, yeah, that's it for now, because I can't remember what else I was going to say, so, I hope that you guys have a lovely Thursday, and a lovely weekend, and keep on baby dancing, guys, I'll talk to you guys later.